Hi, I'm Tom Lazito, and I'd like to tell you about a recent paper from my lab at USC. In this study, we applied stem cell therapy towards improving the fidelity of lizard tail regeneration. Now, many lizards exhibit the amazing ability to regrow amputated tails, but regenerated lizard tails are referred to as imperfect because of important differences compared to original tails. These differences are most obvious when you compare original and regenerated lizard tail skeletons. Instead of patterned vertebral column running along the bottom of the original tails, the regenerated lizard tail skeleton takes the form of a single unpat unpatterned cartilage tube that runs right down the center of the new tail, occupying both the top and bottom parts of the tail. This is referred to as a lack of dorsal ventral patterning. Now lizards have been around for more than 250 million years, and in all that time, no lizard has ever regrown a tail with dorsal ventral patterning until now. My lab has created the first regenerated lizard tails with patterned skeletons. Uh, this study has provided us with essential practice on how to improve an organism's regenerative potential and perfecting the imperfected regenerated tail uh, can provide us with a blueprint for improving healing and wounds that don't naturally regenerate, such as human limbs and spinal cords. In this way, we hope our lizard research will lead to medical breakthroughs for treating hard to heal injuries.